The gentleman from Georgia is recognized for two minutes. I thank the gentlelady. And, Mr. Speaker, we've known for some time that Planned Parenthood is the largest provider of abortions in this country. What we did not know until recently was just how vile and disgusting the nature of this organization truly is. I rise today in support of H.R. 3495 because I believe states have the right to refuse funding to an organization that profits from the sale of aborted children's organs. Medicaid and CMS should not be allowed to force states to fund these horrific practices against the state's wishes. The advancement of women's health should always remain a top priority for our health care community. However, we can achieve this goal without requiring states to provide access to institutions like Planned Parenthood. Taxpayers' dollars should not be going to the killing of born babies. Taxpayers' dollars should not go to organizations like Planned Parenthood that support the practice of abortion and trafficking of aborted fetal tissue. Taxpayers' funds should go towards investigating and prosecuting the individuals that are responsible for trafficking and the selling of fetal tissue. Taxpayers' funds should go towards the advancement of women's health. I encourage my colleagues to support this bill, but we cannot stop here. In addition to cutting off funding, the perpetrators behind these heinous crimes should be prosecuted to the full extent of the law. These disgusting acts are on par with those committed by the sickest of criminals behind bars, and that's exactly where the people who did this belong. I urge my colleagues to support precious innocent lives of the unborn. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I yield back.